It's a very good afternoon and welcome to Saturday, March 24th and the last weekend of daylight saving, well, the second last week actually. And joining me now, it's a very big welcome to Joe Murphy. Welcome back. Hi everybody. Hi Barry. Thanks for having me on the show. And as usual, we've got a smorgasbord of entertain topics. First up, the triple O number. Please do not ring that unless you've got an emergency. Here's my offsider. Thanks, Barry. It's something we've talked about in the past, using the triple zero number when it's not necessary. The requirements for using the number is obviously to be in a time critical uh, and life-threatening situation. Um, so leave those numbers alone and leave them for people who might need them. Such as me, for example, and with people with chest pain and can't, can't get to hospital on time. Here's my offsider. That's right, Barry. As you said, there's people that need that number quite urgently. And if you're using that number as a joke, then what you're doing is taking away those services which people will need urgently. And if you are caught misusing that number, you will be fined mm. and very heavily fined. Here's my offsider. Yeah, that's right. There are consequences um, for people using those numbers and they're only there because of how serious it is to be messing around with those phone numbers. The second topic today on the show, show regarding road safety. Now, it is Good Friday and Easter Saturday next week. So here's Joe now to tell you about staying safe on those roads over the Easter long weekend. Here he is. Yeah, that's right, Barry. It's a time where people choose to get away. There's a lot of people on the roads and it can be a very unsafe time. Um, I believe there's double demerits around this time of year, which is very important, I, I feel, because there are a lot of people there eager to go away to their holidays and more inclined to taking risks. And, so, yeah. and speaking of double demerits, they start on Thursday night at midnight and conclude at nine at midnight on set on uh, on Monday. So 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 I'm um, so so please do not and speed and see the speed limit. Mm. Here's my upside in now. That's right, Barry. Yeah, stay below the speed limit, and also other offences can be uh, going through a red light, having passengers without their seat belts, and it's also just important to be just overall just drive cautiously and carefully, and don't do anything stupid like drink and drive. This is another. No, no, over the Easter break. So if you are going to be stupid enough, again, there will be consequences here. My offside are right now. Yeah, that, that's right, Barry. Easter in particular is a time where people like to have a drink or two. So think about your plan Bs. Think about other methods of getting around. Maybe ask a friend, get a cab. Um, and don't... Think you're gonna get away with drink driving or speeding because it doesn't work. Here's my offsider. That's right, Barry. As they say on the TV ad, if you're worried, it's because you should be. So don't be trying to take risks because you're not just risking your own life, you're risking that of anyone else on the road. And this is the first of um, my offside many shows back after a while. We welcome him back to the show and hope that you enjoy your time here. And our program today is sponsored by 
called the uh, Brook Bale here in my offside. Yeah, thanks Barry. Firstly, it's great to be back and exciting to be talking to our viewers on YouTube again. Uh, and obviously very important to thank our sponsor there. And, and also we, 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 um, we, we thank everybody for being patient. Here's my offside in now. Yeah, that's right. We, we did another show the other day, but it, unfortunately we, we weren't able to uh, release that one. So we're here doing, doing having another go. We'll always try and update the, the YouTube page as often as we can. Uh, but we do, we do uh, sometimes miss a day here or there, but we'd always try to get stuff up. So, so before we do go today, the, the most important topic is triple zero. And once again, we would like to remind you not to use that number unless you have a time critical emergency. And I can't my offside to tell you about not ringing that number once more before we go today. That's, yeah, thanks for bringing it up again. We would like to leave you today with that message to leave that triple zero number alone, um, especially around Easter. It's a time where there can be emergencies and the roads are very, very blocked up because of the traffic. So we do need to allow those services to make the necessary um, trips to different emergencies where they can. And also do not so triple zero something that hasn't happened because you will be caught. And the very last topic today is daylight savings. So those of you living in Victoria, South Australia, the ACT, Tasmania, with the exception of the Northern Territory, Western Australia and Darwin. Daylight saving finishes next Saturday night or next Sunday morning. So instead of it being half past two, it will be half past one. So here's my offside right now to give you that info now before we head off. Yeah, cheers, Barry. Yeah, it's always um, it's always important around this time of year that we don't remember that we remember to not uh, arrive. I think it's too late to our engagement. So do make sure that if you don't have a, a device that automatically changes, that you are on top of changing the time yourself. Um, and this means which way are we going, Barry? Uh, backwards. Backwards. So please, everyone, just reminding you, take care on those roads. Don't do anything stupid. We know that you like to travel away on the road, but please take your time and don't leave in the middle of the night. Have a good night's sleep and wake up refreshed and go and Stop, revive, survive every two hours and have someone travel um, to share the driving with you if it gets too much. Here's my offside and I'll leave you with the, that quote. Yeah, thanks Barry. I'll just, I'll just finish up by saying thanks to everyone to what, for watching and thanks very much for Barry uh, having me today on the show. Look forward to the next one. And revive, survive, or well, stop reviving, so survive everyone. And here's Joe now with that message. Yeah, that's right, guys. If you're tired on the road, make sure that you do pull over and have, have yourselves a rest. Stretch the legs out if you need to have a coffee. Um, but uh, yeah, make sure that you're not uh, a risk to anyone else on the road because of your tiredness. And just one more time, P please don't, do not 
So the ambulance officers that there is something wrong when they come to your address or holiday home kid my, my offside in there. Yeah, that's right. Thanks, Barry. Um, finally, we don't want we don't want to be abusing those emergency services. So it is important that when you're on the phone to them that you are completely honest and calm. Um, and obviously leave them alone if you aren't in need of an emergency service. Okay, well, that's our first program with my offside at JM, or we call him here, and here he is to farewell the viewers now. Goodbye, everybody. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you guys next time. And next... Saturday is Easter Saturday, so we'll bring you a special program on Easter Saturday next Saturday. But until then, everybody, I'm Barry Fear. You have a great afternoon, and I will catch you next time around on the show. Have a good afternoon. Good afternoon, everybody.